1957, I was working as art director in an advertising agency uh, specialized in uh, luxury goods. And this fashion house, Elsa Caparelli. She was a very difficult woman. So I went there, received by the man who says, Madame is waiting for you in her room. And in fact, she was in her bed uh, with two very nasty dogs like her. And one of the dogs starts to bit me on, on my leg. I shoot the dogs. <laughs> it starts as very, very bad. But then she tells me, oh, I have a friend uh, who wants to do a perfume bottle. You should call her. And this was Ellen Rochas, the wife of the Marcel Rochas fashion designer. And uh, Ellen Rochas asked me to design my first bottle, Madame Rochas, 1959, launched in 1960. And I fall in love with her. That's how it all started. Well, I started the first uh, Calvin Klein with Obsession. The original name was Climax, but that was so bad taste that it was impossible to use the name. But then he decided to still be uh, nearly pornographic to use Obsession. But it was a problem because at the same time I was working for Armani, he asked me, don't work for this man. And Paco Rabanne had an idea to do a bottle inspired by a couple making love in a car. So I said it might as well be a big car where they need space. And they said, yes, why not a Rolls Royce? And that, out of this idea, I only picked the grill of the front of the car. The exact story that Opium was designed originally for Kenzo. As Kenzo is Japanese, I decided to do a Japanese object, this Inro object. But then uh, Kenzo looked at the bottle and say, it is too Japanese. It's never going to work. Then Pierre Berger calls me and say, he uh, wants to do a new bottle. Come to Marrakesh and so I go to Marrakesh. I will stay with them in their beautiful house of Maison de Majorelle. He tells me I want something orientalist. And then I propose to him the Inro bottle. He immediately approved it and said, this is where the time samurai put their salt and their opium pills. And the name came from the Inro design. Big success. When Sarah and Jeff sent me my baby, the map of the art, an idea and of a, a bottle in the shape of a heart, so irregular and so asymmetrical. And I think out of the nearly thousand bottles I ever made, it has been the most difficult bottle to achieve. The result is absolutely outstanding. People like it or hate it but I like the controversy. Imagine a mix of Schiaparelli, Palma, Christian Dior, Armani, Isadora, Givenchy, Karl Lagerfeld, Calvin Klein, all together, and that comes to my brain. And such an incredible influence, which is absolutely unique.